Lincoln and Margaret met while filming Vita Las Vegas in 1963, and they hit it off instantly. When they were not filming, Elvis and Ann Margaret were always together. Members of Elvis's Memphis Mafia said anyone who saw Elvis and Ann Margaret together could see the chemistry. Elvis Presley had a hard decision to make because Elvis had a living girlfriend at that time, and that being Priscilla. Well, when Ann Margaret led a rumor to the news that her and Elvis were engaged, this got back to Priscilla, and she confronted Elvis, and then Elvis' decision was made, and he cut ties with Ann Margaret at that time. But later, Elvis explained to Ann Margaret the truth. Elvis Presley and Ann Margaret had that connection that never ended. Elvis always kept up with Ann Margaret's career and whereabouts. Ann Margaret said in a 1994 interview that we parted with a tenderness that seemed to say we both knew we'd be in each other's hearts forever. But it was still very painful. Elvis Presley always sent a special gift to Ann Margaret. Elvis had rose to shape like a guitar sent to Ann Margaret every time she opened a show in Las Vegas. And on August 16th of 1977, when Ann Margaret opened up the show in Vegas, no roses, and Ann knew something was wrong. And she later found out that Elvis Presley passed away on August 16th of 1977. She was devastated and just heartbroken. Anne did attend Elvis's funeral, and when she walked into the doors of Graceland, she saw Vernon, and they hugged and cried together. And as they hugged, Vernon related a message to Anne Margaret. He said, Elvis was so proud of you. Anne Margaret truly loved 